where to stay in Phuket Old Town. Hi, this is the Sinlo House. Welcome to the hotel. Actually, this is one of the best locations in terms of uh, convenience. You know, it's, it's so easy access to the Old Town. You just walk five minutes to get to the heart of the town. It's located on the Dibuk Road. Actually, this is the, the orchard area for the town. It's more of the resident area. And then this hotel is used to be uh, probably like 100 years ago. It used to be motorcycle repairing uh, spare part shop. So uh, after that, you know, they closed down the shop. The next generation turned the shop into the hotel. And conceptually, the hotel is quite nice. Uh, they use the concept of being the, the spare part of the motorcycle and then turn it into the hotel. So the hotel is in a, a chop house size, so it's a little bit tiny at, in front, and then but the house is super long. So you have uh, you will keep walking until the end of the tunnel. You will see the house is simply very long. Look in the room, how it is, and then today we stay at the Exit Lot 21. Ta -ta! The room is quite big, clean, nice and neat, and actually it's quite spacey for two people. Have a look at our own balcony. Once you get to the balcony, this is the Dibuk Road. Like I said before, it's the orchard area for the town where all the rich residents used to be here. So uh, if you see the, the whole road, probably like only one kilometer, uh, you will get to see a lot of beautiful residential shop house. And then you can walk around. And also the, uh, the old mansion. I think that mansion belongs to Luang Amna Narara. And this one probably uh, 110 or more years old. This is the a typical chop house in Phuket because the chop house is quite long, it's like 70 meters uh, or 100 meters. So they will divide it into three parts. The very first part is for the commercial. Second part will be more of the living room and the uh, cleaning up and then uh, for the family activities and then later in the, at the end of the house will be the kitchen. So in the middle of the house, usually they will have the open space like this. Uh, so it will help the, the, the wind circulation so it will cool down the whole temperature of the house without having air conditioning. Based on the concept, I think the hotel has done quite a good job, you know. They try to put, you know, some small little uh, details in the hotel and it seems like it works. Even though it's not 100%, if they can get up to 100%, it will be perfect. For me, the hotel is worth the value for money. Um, just want to suggest this hotel, the Sin Law House, because of the great location. It's near the old town, and you have the one of the best coffee place in town, right opposite. And also um, the old mansion that you can take picture early in the morning without you know going very far. For this hotel, I think um, even though it's not a five star hotel, you know it, but uh, I think the whole thing. Uh, pulling it together, I think it was value for money.